What's up, y'all? It's your boy, J.D. Aroma Plug, back again with another video for you guys. And today I'm going to be talking about a fragrance from the house of Tom Ford. And it is their 2007 release, Tobacco Vanille. Um, I have a sample here from Scent Split. You can see that there, Tobacco Vanille. Um, this is definitely one of, I would say, the most favorite Tom Ford fragrances. Um, if you look at a lot of people's rankings and how they uh, rank the Tom Ford fragrances from the from the Private Blends collection. Um, I commonly see Tobacco Vanille ranked extremely high. Um, and it's, it's a Tom Ford fragrance that I don't own a full bottle of. So um, I wanted to get a, a sample and smell it again and uh, let you guys know my thoughts on it. Um, I say again because I'm pretty sure I had to have smelled this at some point and I don't quite remember it. Um, but I know it's not a bottle that I that I currently own. So I bought a sample of it since I've just it's just been coming across my I guess my algorithms a lot recently and I've been seeing it in a lot of videos and um, just online and, and fragrance communities being talked about and a lot of people have this as not only their favorite Tom Ford fragrance but one of their favorite fragrances of all time. Uh, so I say, you know what? Let me let me get a let me get a decan of that. Let me let me try it out. Um, you know, let you guys know what I think about it, and you know, give y'all my opinion. So let's uh, first talk about the the notes in tobacco vanille. So the top notes are tobacco leaf, uh, spice and spicy notes. Uh, middle notes we have vanilla, uh, cacao, tonka bean, and tobacco blossom. And the base notes are dried fruits. Mm, I, I usually like dried fruits, so okay. But let's let's see about that. Um, and woody notes and the base notes. All right, so let me give it a spray. And I'm gonna give y'all my thoughts on tobacco vanille and whether I think you know this is something that that you should have in your collection. Give it a nice two sprays. Hmm, okay. Um this is this is heavy, heavy on the tobacco. Um Yeah, I I'm I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I, I don't I don't get it. Um, this is like, this is like straight tobacco. This is like, um, I don't know, like, this is like the, the guts of like a, of a cigarello. Like, like it's, that's, that's what it smells like to me. It's like, like the guts of, of like a, a cigarello. Um, like a, a, a swish of sweet or something like it, it's I don't really understand the I don't get the appeal um, yeah it to me I mean this is it's it's just not this isn't something that I I want to wear when I smell it um, it kind of reminds me of like like the like the holiday owl of like a at, a at a supermarket or party city or something we have like all the holiday decorations and stuff it, it's it doesn't smell like something that i want to wear or something that i really want to smell like um but a lot of people love this fragrance um it's just not for me i i mean i'll just i'll just leave it at that um you know i definitely wouldn't blind buy this if you don't own it you definitely want to sample this it's not for everybody, um, you know, but like I said, a lot of people do gravitate towards this fragrance and apparently love it, but I I just can't see myself wanting to smell like this for really any occasion. Um, and I love Tom Ford. Tom Ford has some of my favorite fragrances, especially the Private Blends Collection fragrances. 
Um, but this one just just isn't for me. So, um, you know, let me know what you guys think in the comments. If you like tobacco vanilla or if you love tobacco vanilla, uh, you know, let me know what it is about it that that um, that you like um, or that you love. Um, if you agree with me and it's something that you just don't see the hype around, you know, let me know as well. Uh, so like, subscribe, comment, let me know your thoughts, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.